The Sun River Nature <laughs> Center and Observatory is finishing up phase one of its expansion project. Bola Badabo went to find out what changes have been made in the observatory. Bola? The good news, Lee, is that it's expanded its footprint twice as large as it was before. With the added space and equipment, I was told the guest experience will be better. Once you go visit, you'll be able to see far more fascinating targets in the night sky than before. Sun River Nature Center and Observatory is just one week away from completing a half a million dollar observatory expansion. The additions to the project include exhibit space, a new electronic roof, and six telescopes, one of which shows solar prominence around the sun. So we actually can operate anywhere from 12 to 20 telescopes easily during a crowded night. Observatory manager Bob Grossfeld says it makes a big difference because they'll be able to show people more objects in the sky in a shorter amount of time. I don't like waiting in line. I'm sure you don't like waiting in line. The wait times were super long. People were waiting 10, 12 minutes to look through a telescope. We had lines pretty deep. This last summer I don't think we had a line bigger than five people and it was usually a family group around a telescope. He expects an increase from the initial 200 to 300 guests that were coming in pre-COVID. He says they'll be taking reservations only to limit capacity. Additionally, they will offer different programming with viewing sessions ranging from 30 minutes to two hours. They'll also hold private group sessions. The observatory expansion is just phase one of the project. So we still have some work to do inside the facility as far as painting and some of the interior walls are still being uh, finished up and lighting and electrical is still being finished up. An open house for the observatory is Saturday and reservations are required to attend. Utility work has started for phase two of the project, which will include the Discovery Center Planetarium. Grossfeld says they're in the process of raising money for that and plan to have it completed in a couple of years. Grossfeld said it's one of the few facilities where guests can look directly at the sun with the telescopes, offering a unique perspective. Lee, back to you.